Hi again, Laughlin's back, and I am going to continue Ford Square. I've enjoyed this pack, but it's pretty hard. A couple of stuff is hard. Yeah, I like the one with um, the temporal tokens, as you've seen. I'm doing those later, but I'm trying to tackle what I can get done. So let's get going. Oh my gosh, Roach Queens and Rock Golems! Okay. Where do I start? That looks just about right. What? What's the point of that section? The one with the, near the rock golem? What's the point of that? Well, I guess for decoration purposes? Eh. Oh well. Okay. This is where it gets really chaotic. We'll wait till we get to 30. Ready? 3, 2, 1. too bad. I thought that'd be trickier than I thought. Yay, Serpent Puzzle with, what are they called again, Water Skippers? Oh my gosh. A pickaxe is. Ooh, more chaos. Ah, that's how it's done. Nope, that's not how it's done. Come on, serpent. Come on, come to Papa. Come to Papa Bithra. Come to Papa Budkin. Hey, serpent, come on. Come to Papa. Great puzzle! Okay, another goblin puzzle, and Wubba! Oh my gosh, Wubba's! Oh my gosh, they were such a pain in, like, level 5 of Draw to Ruin Hold! Ah! Oh. Fortunately, they're not worth destroying. The only thing you destroy is goblins. Although, Wubba's can be destroyed by bombs as well, so... To get the Wubba to the point where Goblin cannot escape. Huh, how far does the bomb explode? Oh yeah, in the, in the um, yellow section. Okay, so what can Wubba do? Stuff now. <laughs> Come, Wubba, help me out.
It's annoying me. Come on, goblin. I'm just taking so many checkpoints now. Make up your mind, goblin. Alright, how about I try this? Put Wubba in there. On the top and the goblin on the on the upper right here. Right about here. Right about here. Put goblin here and put Wubba here. See if this works. But then Wubba will follow me to the top, so I don't want that. So how about put the Wubba here and the goblin here instead? See if that works. Come on, Wubba! Help me out here! Stop! Whoa, why would the monster help me out all the time? They are monsters. Ah, goblin, get in! You know who you're just like? You know that episode of Spongebob called Gary Takes a Bath? Yeah, you're just like him. You don't want to get in that little square, you just want to follow me. But what's the point? There's walls in the way. Get in the square! In the square! In the square! Okay... Is there a brain somewhere? Goblin, stop. make up your mind already. Stop following me. Follow the Wubba or something. Why are you chasing me? There's a wall between the two of us.
Is that help? That is help. I haven't seen him in a while. I think Hal should be the one to do this. That is correct though. Oh, yeah, definitely not correct. It's house we should go. Oh, I get it, I think. So, I should get myself in there. Maybe kill Evil Eye first. And then go inside there, lock myself in. Actually, kill both evil eyes first, and get myself locked in here. Have Hal um, open this door. But then, but to get to this orb, you have to. Okay, let's try my original plan first. It might devolve from there. At this point, I'm getting really confused. We want him to open that one. Oh, it opens both this and that. Okay, so... Evil Eye must block this. Oh, I get it now, I think. Stick puzzle. Hey, it's the it's a gentry eye. Back off, gentry eye. Don't don't touch me. No touchy. How do I get that roach? Oh, I have to go all the way there. Oh, Mimic! That's right. Oh, 
Oh no! So the gentry can only follow me if I'm inside? Remember, I haven't played Draught in a while, so I wouldn't know the gentry mechanics too much. Gentry on. You wouldn't want him as a pet, would you? Okay, maybe I'll just come back here later. Hey, it's a guard! With, um, briars. That's what they're called. I really forget. Okay, this one is annoying. He'll have to hit all the lights first. Okay, there's another confusing puzzle already. I can already tell. Okay, I'll come back here later. These are really confusing.
Okay, more briars. What were they supposed to be called? Fluff vent. Ooh. to the Roach Queens. Oh, it's the Briar that takes care of the Roach Queens. Gotcha, gotcha. But how do I get these doors open? Oh, no. So they can't touch the... And the briar also destroys the... Okay. All the fluff covers the one, the pressure plate, and then the briar should go over it. Okay, is nothing happening anymore? Alright folks, this will take a while. Worked. 
Alright, so we pretty much got all the rooms I could beat. Okay. Let's go back to that Rose Queen room. to do here. Um, get the roach queen. This thing confuses me.
up to now, this can still confuse me. I'll probably come back later. Anyone's welcome to give me hints until then. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna try that again. Let's try the temporal token room again. Alright, if this gets too hard and Sebastian can... I'll look at Sebastian's um, hint. But as he said, the fun part about George experimenting... I don't get it. Every move you make, um, there's always, um, the fire always comes out, no matter what you do. Ouch! Nope. Okay, why is it like with a timer? Like, temporal tokens here? Where is it? Okay, temporal split token. A temporal projection of play will carry the same action against it, or the player is to take a different path in parallel. Okay. tried yet. I tried pushing the bee throw into the fire track, but he always gets hurt. If I wait, 
fire truck goes off. Any move I make, the, the fire truck goes off. Can I hit it twice? Only one. Fire can can pull up the staff. I guess that's what it's called. Every step I make, every step I make, cause the fire thing to go off. So why? Even just waiting causes this. Is there one thing that I'm missing? Let me look at the fire traps again. Yeah, as Sebastian said, there's not enough information there. There's no way to turn it off. Alright, let's look at the staff. Let's see what the staff does. Forgot to look at that. The staff has no sharp edges and cannot kill monsters directly. However, most monsters can be pushed with the staff and directly will cause to be stunned for one turn. The staff can also be used to push mirrors and powder kegs and can, and can pass through bombs without exploding them. The staff is not affected by more might. That doesn't explain much either. Be caused to be stunned for one turn, so I can stun my temporal self as well. What happens when I do that? I'm stuck here. Which is good. What have I not tried yet? I'm pretty much out of ideas.
all this wibbly wobbly timing that drives you nuts. <laughs> Alright, let's observe myself first. Okay, so for every move I make, the same he goes he moves at the same time. If I wait, he moves. If I move, he moves. But if I hit him with a staff, nope, not by stabbing. Nope! If I hit him, I click him around, he doesn't move. Alright, can the temple throw the pitch against the itself against the wall? Alright, I'm just myself again. Hurting yourself, B throw. Boggling. What does it take to go over a fire trap? Every si every single move. Okay, I'm just thinking things over and over. Wait, 
What? Okay, wait. Let's let's see the order. So if I move. We move at the same time, actually. Okay, I still can't figure this out, so yeah, I'll stop right here for now because I've gone over 45 minutes, but yeah. My name is Waffle, and I'll see you next time.